Charles Oliveira. Our tale of the tape for this featherweight fight. Farrow is two years his senior. Oliveira will have a four inch reach it. You ready to fight? You ready? And we are live and underway here at the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. That one hurt. <laughs> he missed with that jab attempt. He's just landed an outstanding leg kick. And he's, che he's checking every single one of those. Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Oliveira gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Burrell gets caught with that punch. Oliveira's head kick looked like that one was blocked. A nice punch there by Burrell. Throwing that jab, no good. Oliveira gets tagged by that stiff jab. Defense not there for him thus far tonight. Good defense there. Shoots in for the takedown. Oh, man, the canvas is shaking as he slams him down. In half guard. Elbow now to the head. That one landed by Oliveira. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Full side control. Elbow strike there by Hennen Varak. He's in half guard. Caught him with a punch. Varak ground and pound from half guard. It looks like he may be attempting a submission here. Throws the other leg over the face. He's got that arm bar locked in. That was a deep arm bar, but a beautiful escape. He's in full guard. Back up. Switching stances here. Oh, roundhouse kick. Add that to his highlight reel. Hit him with a jab. Good defense here, Joe, as the hook to the head is blocked. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Wow. Oh! This could be it right here. He is going after it here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Now goes in and secures the takedown. 30 seconds now to go in the opening round. Oh, and he connects there. 20 seconds now remain in the round. It looks to me like he's trying to turn towards either side. Wow, gets the takedown. Now let's see if he chooses to pass here, Joe. The horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, round two. Look for him to go on the attack early in this round to try to pick up where he left off in the last round. His opponent was dazed and in big trouble when that round ended. Henan Barrow is one of the very best fighters in the world today. A world-class ground game as well as explosive, dynamic kicking and punching ability. Trying to establish that jab once again. Henan Barrow attacking the body. That is spot on, Joe. A pretty good knee to the body by Oliveira. See the total strikes. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Oliveira. Rips the body there. How about that shin? He's doing a fantastic job of blocking shots. And he connects with the punch. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Well, you're playing with fire there. He left the body wide open there, and he has shown an increased vulnerability to that strike, Joe, by leaning in, almost moving into the strike to set up his own offense. We'll see if he lowers that guard, lowers those elbows to prevent further damage. 
Oh, a nice punch out of the break there after he had caught the leg. So he is really starting to put it all together now and clearly seems to have found the timing of his opponent. Good knee to the body. Huge kick to the body. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Let's see if he can pass that half guard. Oh, reversal. Oliveira's got a bruise now, starting to appear on the right side of his body. Looks like he's trying to set up some sort of choke here, Joe. He's out of the guillotine. Controlling him from behind. Oliveira gets back up, back into his comfort zone. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Less than a minute to go in the round. Looking to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Hennen Barat. Throwing that jab now again, the fighter of eight. Nice knee to the body by Corral. Watch the shot here, Joe. 20 seconds to go round two. Pretty good jab there by Corral. Oh, excellent exchange there. Nice leg kick. Oliveira working hard for that takedown. Oh, right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so that's the end of the round. He got some things done offensively, but defense still an issue. Third round underway. All right, so the next round is underway here. We set off the top. This was very good matchmaking, evenly matched fighters, and that's exactly how it played out in the last round, which was very good. Not outstanding, but high-level MMA action on both sides. We'll see if one fighter can take control here. Oliveira's overhand punch to the head doesn't get there blocked by the defense. And he's looking for that left. He's fainting with the punch. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. He's blocking almost all these shots. We show you the total strikes. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Nice jab there by Oliveira. He's doing a great job blocking these shots. He landed there as usual by Oliveira. Gets tagged again on the inside. Oh, Barrow's cut on his nose. Does not look good, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you have a strong stomach. The doctor's gonna come in and take a look. Well, he gets cracked in the head there, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's almost moving into the strike at this point in time. You gotta get that head off the center line. Try to establish that jab. Look at that nasty jab, and he lands a very nice combination. He's doing a great job of blocking things here. Oliveira gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Nice defense there, huge block. Level change there. Oh, oh nice take the slam to... Under two minutes now to go in the fight. He's doing a great job of moving and transitioning here on the ground. Half guard here. Effective strike there by Barat. Good shot to the body. Under a minute now to go on the fight. Very nice sweep, winds up in his opponent's guard. He's gonna try to take the back, I think. Oh, so an interesting decision there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. 
Punch coming, it's blocked. Olivera's lower jaw now, Joe, started to show some signs of swelling. Oh, one, two. Showing the punch. That's a well-timed knee to the body, Joe. It's in. He's deep. He's gonna clasp the hands together. And here's the end. Round one, we can see this kick land with beautiful technique. Round three, some serious torque and power behind that leg kick. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Judge one scores this contest, 29-28, Rivera da Silva. Judge two scores it, 29-28, Morale. And judge three scores it, 29-28, for the winner by split decision, Hedden, the Baron Barrow! All right, so... You gotta get it.